just want to show you quickly how you can use remarketing on Facebook now. It's pretty cool. Um, there used to be companies that you had to sign up with in order to use remarketing. And all remarketing means is, say I visit your website, and now you want to continue showing your ads to me on Facebook. Well, uh, in order to do so, you would have to set up a remarketing list on Facebook. So it's really not difficult to do at all. And I'm gonna show you how very quickly that uh, we can do this. So first just go to Facebook and go to uh, the ads manager, which is right here. And it'll load. And then down here on the left, you can see audiences. So click on that. And then what we wanna do is create an audience here. And down at the bottom, you can see custom audience. So we'll create a custom audience from your website. Click on that. And then this is what it says. So remarketing is tactic for identifying people who took a specific action on your website. So one of the most successful forms of finding users who have expressed an interest in your business, meaning they've been to your site before. So in order to do this, we need to use the remarketing pixel and that just tracks the behavior of it and it allows you to do some pretty cool things but we're just going to show you a very basic way to do it we're just going to find people that have been to your site and we're going to continue showing them ads on facebook you can do advanced things like if they went to your site and tried to buy something and then abandoned the cart then you could actually do campaigns dedicated to those people or you could say uh, hey we noticed you didn't follow through um, here's another deal try this or anything like that anyway uh, you have to click, I've already done it, so um, yours might look different, but you want to click on view the code, and then you click on the checkbox. So I'll just click this, and you can see the code, and I just copy it. And then, so I've got this copied to my clipboard, and I'll click on create audience. And for this one, I'm going to use my site. And now I'm just going to use all website visitors. You can do people who are searching for specific pages or visiting specific pages. So on my site, um, I have people that, you know, there's a the front sales page, there's a contact us, about us, frequently asked questions, the sign up page that I could put this on, or the blog, any blog post that they saw I could put this on, and I could just put the keywords from the URL if I want. Um, it's pretty, very powerful that way. So I am just going to do all visitors for this and I'm going to do 180 days because that's the maximum that we can do. Then I click create and basically that's it in Facebook. So I click on OK. Now I need to go to my website here and I'll log in. It's WordPress for me. I don't want to update the password. And I just go to my um, editor. So under appearance, I'm just going to go to editor. And you'll see, I'm basically just going to put this in the footer. So if I go here, and then I scroll down, you can see. So I just scroll down, and then down at the bottom here, I'm going to put in the actual code for it. And then, so I pasted it right in here. You can see the code. And then I click update file. And now it is ready for me to use. So now if I go to my site on PPC Coach, just the main page, show you what I can do. So you won't see the actual code here, but if I go, oh, that's my little popover. If I go like this, view page source, and then scroll down, you'll see that code is right here. So that is my Facebook remarketing pixel installed. And now my actual campaign is also ready to go in Facebook. So now what I can do is I can go into Facebook and I cre can create an ad campaign only to target people that have been to my website. Pretty cool, eh? I can show you how to do that maybe in another video at another time, not promising anything, but uh, have a look at that and get that installed on your site now. And if you have any questions, let me know.